you guys so in today's video I'm gonna be talking about eyeliner um to kind of give you like a background I wear eyeliner all the time like if I'm wearing makeup I have I like liquid liner on my top lash line and I don't like eyeliners that have like the wet shiny finish to them I like the ones that finish that have like the matte finish so I'm gonna be showing you my favorites there's gonna be like three little categories I have like my ultimate favorite the ones that I'm okay with, and then the ones that I kind of like, mm, maybe I should not have bought. To start off, the first one is the NYC Liquid Liner in Black. And it's just a black eyeliner. It has the little brush type of applicator. And I love this. It is so black. And then also it dries like super matte. Um, and this you could find, these are, I also forgot to mention, these are all like drugstore eyeliners. I prefer, not that I prefer, but I can't justify myself buying like a high-end eyeliner when there's like drugstore eyeliners that I really like. So, these can all be found at a drugstore. So, like I said, this is the NYC um, in just black. The next one is, this one I used for years. It's the Alme Liquid Liner in Black, and I absolutely love this. It has the, it has a felt tip, but it's the like stiff felt tip applicator. So like I said, I used this for years until I decided to like venture out and try different products and stuff like that. So this was a favorite for years, and I mean like five, six, maybe since like 06 or something, 2006. So definitely for a long time. So I really like that eyeliner and all of these so far, um, these two eyeliners, they have, a, you know, for my eyes and my skin and stuff, they have good stay power and that brings us on to the last one. It is this Physician's Formula. It's the two-in-one eyeliner. It has like, um, it's a two-in-one lash boosting eyeliner with serum. So this product claims to be waterproof. It's supposed to like help make your eyelashes look fuller and thicker. And then it's also, it has like a serum to like help your eyelashes, um, I, I don't know, like grow or something. But I can actually vouch that I really do think this works. Um, I didn't think, I was very skeptical when I got it about it helping my actual lashes. But I love the eyeliner, like the actual product. And then it does stay on for a long time. It claims to stay on for 24 hours. I've never left it on for that long, but I have had it on for like long periods of time and it like stays on. And it's waterproof. It's just like really good stuff. The only thing that I'm like, that, I don't know, I don't really like it, but like it's still, okay, let me just tell you what it is. It has kind of like the teeniest bit, like when it finished, like when the finish is kind of wet looking, like shiny kind of but I like the actual eyeliner can't even talk but I like the actual eyeliner enough to kind of overlook that just because I love the product so much and like what it does and stuff like that so those were like my top three I guess you could say um the Almay one I've kind of thrown to like the back burner to where I don't use it as much but I do really like the formula and the eyeliner and stuff this next one can be in my ultimate favorite like little first category or whatever it's the NYX super skinny marker in carbon black the only reason that it's not is because you cannot wear this as far as I go the first time I tried it I tried it without any eyeshadow like I just wanted some black liner and you know run out the door and it would spread and it just looked like very light and watery and not really black so at first I was kind of and this has the little Oh, I forgot to show you. Um, pause. The Physician's Formula tip is the little pen type applicator, which makes it so, so, so easy to apply eyeliner. Like, it makes it so easy. I would recommend that for beginners. And the Super Skinny Marker has, it looks like a marker. And so, like I was saying, it is kind of watery and stuff, but when you put it on top of eyeliner, or eyeliner when you put it in top of eyeshadow it just works amazing and it has a completely matte finish so I love it but I don't like that um, it you can't wear it alone or you know I can't wear it alone I don't know it might be different for everyone else like these are all just personal preference you know stuff I like and whatnot so 
yeah, there's this one. And then the next one is this Palladio um, liquid liner in lavender, which is like a purple. And this one also has that like um, the felt tip, but that it's like stiff. And this one, I like, I bought it because I wanted to buy like, you know, a different colored eyeliner besides like back, back, besides black and brown. So I tried this one and I like it. Like you can tell that I have it on, but you, it doesn't really look purple because it's metallic. It's like a metallic purple. So now when I wear it, so now when I wear it, um, See how it's metallic I like to put like gel liner first like a thin line of gel liner and then I'll do um, the liquid liner on top like literally right on top of it like layering eyeliner just to make it a bit darker and so you can really see it um the next two are the same brand and they are the elf liquid liners in coffee and black and these are like I was at first when I first got them I was like in love with them because I thought they worked amazing for their price but they really do work good and they both have the same tip which is the little felt tip that's kind of stiff but mine is kind of like more soft towards the tip does that make sense um so that's these and they this one's really black really brown i like them i think if you don't put them on top of eyeshadow they can be kind of watery like the nyx so I usually like to wear these with eyeshadow. The last three, um, I think we'll go with this one. And I know that every, like, I've seen a lot of people just like love this. It's the L'Oreal Linear Intense Carbon Black. But for me, I dislike the fact that it has that wet, kind of shiny finish to it. It just bugged me. Like, I hate that when you're turning your head, like the light reflects off of it. And it just looks like all shiny and stuff. And I'm just like, well, like I don't like that. Um, the actual like product, you know, it stays on and I love the tip. It has that like flexible tip that you can just kind of like bend and do whatever you want to. So like I really love the tip. Not so big on the actual finish of the eyeliner, but I still use it or whatever. And then, did I tell you guys what category I was on? This is my last one, the ones that I kind of wish I wouldn't have wasted my money on. So this one, I'm kind of like, oh, whatever, I have it, so I have to use it. The next one is the Revlon Color Stay Eyeliner in, I think it's just black. What's the black one? And this one also has that, like, stiff felt tip. And the thing I don't like about this eyeliner is that it cracks. Like, it starts chipping and it cracks. I remember when I started using it, um... I would put it on and then I would go to like curl my lashes and just any like anything that you move your eye with it would just start cracking and chipping off and oh like I hated that so this one I definitely regret buying my sister uses it which I think she uses it I think she uses this one I don't know how she can use it because I hate it but I have it and this is actually the one that I keep in my makeup bag in my purse just if I ever need a touch up or anything I'll use it but you know whatever and the last one is this covergirl um little mini what's that mini it's a full size but the liquid liner and this is in brown and it has the little flexible felt tip which i really really like but the actual eyeliner i don't like because it does also chip and it's kind of watery so i'll use it in top of eyeshadow some of these like i can't use alone because they're kind of watery and some of them are just black like I love so yeah that's pretty much it I just kind of wanted to give you guys like my eyeliner like my three little categories like my favorite my okay ones and then my wish I shouldn't have bought but to be honest with you these are my current favorites these is the physicians formula the NYC and the NYX super skinny marker um these are like my current favorites today I used I think I used the super skinny marker because I'm wearing eyeshadow um, but yeah so today I use this one but these are like the ones I'm rotating right now um, these I'll wear like alone and this one like I have to wear with eyeshadow or whatever but 
yeah and then also you guys oh my gosh i was gonna do a tutorial for this look and i don't know if it's because i have like a new camera or whatever but when i was doing the tutorial i was like this like you can't even see what i'm doing because i'm like so out of like out of the frame i was just like man but yeah that pretty much completes this little video i hope it was helpful and if you're maybe interested in any of these eyeliners i hope my little kind of input on them helps you or whatever so yeah but if you guys have any questions let me know and i will talk to you guys later